The Woody Allen travelogue continues. You're watching Review. that you're still hurting from the failure of your marriage to marry Elena and to be perfectly frank, Juan Antonio, I'm engaged to be married. And you? I'll go to your room, but you have to seduce me. Why were you so nervous? <laughs> I mean, nothing to worry about. I was in love with the most incredible woman and she put a knife into me. My God, that's terrible. Well, maybe you did something to deserve it. Christina, this is Marielena. Things didn't work out for her. And she has to stay here. I don't like her for you. I don't trust her. You went through my luggage? Who knew what I would find there? After all, I have thoughts of killing you. What? Vicky Cristina Barcelona. For the latter part of his career, Woody Allen has stayed in the public eye by constantly reinventing himself. First as a pedophile, and now as an expat who only makes movies outside the United States. This time, Allen moves the action to Spain, telling the story of two American women traveling abroad who fall in love with a local artist. But the artist is still in love with his mentally unstable ex. Javier Bardem stars alongside Scarlett Johansson and Penelope Cruz, who make out. Allen is determined to have one of his movies do well at the box office. What movie did you just see? I just had Vicky Cristina Barcelona. How was it? It was awesome. What did you like about it? I like everything. I like that. It captured the spirit of Barcelona. I was just telling my friend that I've been to Barcelona and everything that was shown in the film is what you typically do in Barcelona. So the concept, the atmosphere. <laughs> yeah. Well, that too, if you run into the perfect people. It's really a film about human relationships, uh, including sexual relationships, which I thought very uh, interesting. It was, it was okay. Why only okay? Uh, I just I thought I would love it more. I, uh, I like Woody Allen and I like Match Point a lot and a lot of his other films, but this is not, I wouldn't put this one up on the list of his best films for me, for me. So who do you think did the best job? I think they all did a good job. I liked the actress that played Vicky. She was very good. Penelope Cruz kicked ass in this film. The girl, uh, Rebecca Hall, kind of steals the first half of the movie. Oh, great. And um, Penelope Cruz, of course, steals the second half. Oh, with this film, do you think like, do you think Woody Allen is like moving on to the new generation of filmmaking with Scarlett Johansson? Um, I think so. Yeah, and, and kind of and kind of him stepping out of it and not even yeah. narrating it or even acting in it. Yeah. Where would you rate it with other Woody Allen movies? Right near the top somewhere. Oh really? Wow. Really liked it a lot. Is there anything else you want to say to moviegoers? Is this something to see in theaters? Is it a rental? What no, you it's definitely go see it in theaters. You have to see movies that take place in a city as beautiful as Barcelona. You have to see it in a big picture. Somehow the TV kind of, you miss things. And it's just good to see it in a big theater screen. So while Woody Allen tries to woo a younger demographic, poor Tony Roberts is left sitting by the phone. That's it for review. Be sure to check us out next week.